Hi, Brentech here. Where tech is made simple. So Brave version 1.60 is now available, which is the latest release. And this latest version upgrade started rolling out on the 2nd of November and also bumps up the Chromium version, which the browser is based on, to version 1.19. Now, once again, just apologies for my voice. I've got a bit of the flu, so I sounded a bit croaky. So um, obviously, I apologize for that, and I hope you can make sense of what I'm trying to say. Now, first of all, with Brave version 160, like most Brave releases, there's quite a lot going on. And the big one with this update is they have added Brave Leo, which is Brave's AR chatbot equivalent to Google's Bard and um, Microsoft's Bing Chat. Now, basically, Brave Leo um, AR is for questions and answers, Brave says, leveraging page context and integrated into the sidebar when rolled out in phases. Now, currently, it is on a controlled rollout, and most, including myself, are not seeing the new Brave Leo, which will appear in the address bar and the sidebar if you are the fortunate 20% to see the new chatbot in this version upgrade. And if you are like myself and the rest of the 80% who are not seeing it, then um, we'll have to wait a couple of weeks before that rolls out. Now, um, Brave has this to say, basically about the new uh, chatbot. They say, a Leo Brave's browser AI assistant can help with all sorts of tasks. It can create real-time summaries of pages or videos. It can answer questions about content or generate new content. It can even translate pages, analyze them, rewrite them, and a whole lot more. So as mentioned, this is Brave's chatbot equivalent now using artificial intelligence, similar to the likes of Google Bard and Microsoft's Bing Chat. And um, there are going to be two versions available, a free version and then a, premi a premium version, which will cost you $15 per month. And I'm sure the premium version will have a little bit more uh, features and a lot more going on compared to the free version. And I have posted a whole video previously on the native AI system called Leo for Brave Browser. And I'll leave that down below if you want a little bit more info. Now, moving on to a couple of the other new features, which I think you may be interested in. First of all, um, if we move to the sidebar and side panel, they've added title to reading list side panel. So there's now a UR with reading list in that uh, side panel. And then bookmarks, the same applies. Add title to bookmarks side panel. Then over and above that, we get three security fixes that have rolled out for the actual Brave browser. Then if you are using vertical tabs, um, they've updated the behavior of um, for the vertical tabs display when in full screen mode. And then um, sponsored images, which are part of the crypto side of things with Brave Browser. And they've updated the display frequency for new tab page sponsored images. And they've also updated the new tab page sponsored image counter to reset every 24 hours. And then if you are using... Um, Brave News, they've updated the design of Brave News feed cards. And then if we just head over to settings, when it comes to the social blocking, they've moved that to Brave Settings Shields. And here you'll see we get uh, the social media blocking now has been made available under Shields. And then if we head to the Get Started page, They've also moved Brave Settings new tab to the Get Started page. So yeah, you've got your new tab um, settings as well, which are found now on that Get Started page. So those are a couple of UR adjustments. And then um, there are four fixes that have rolled out for the browser. So if you have experienced any problems, uh, just make sure you have this update. And then, of course, we get the all-important security fixes that have rolled out with the latest Chromium update to version 119. So as always, to double check that we have this latest version, we head to our main menu, Help About Brave. And as mentioned, latest version in bold, 1.60.110. Latest Chromium platform update, 119.0.6045.105. And that's exactly the same now as Google Chrome. And um, the Chromium platform has received 15 security fixes. Three are high risk, which is the second highest after a critical. And then we get a couple of mediums and we get a couple of lows. So 
Um, over and above those new features, some important security updates have rolled out. And then if we click on the, um, the version, this takes us to the release notes. And here we can see a couple of Web3 um, improvements and fixes and so on, which is always common, that, and that's the crypto side of things. So if you want more info regarding Web3, just head to the release notes and check that out for yourself. So nonetheless, that's more or less just a couple of key highlights that um, I have pulled out from the release notes that I thought you may be interested in and may be of benefit. And that's the latest version upgrade to Brave version 1.60 with Chrome version 119. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.